Good evening and welcome to We Repair. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to uh, reset, a factory reset, a Samsung Tab. Um, this, this particular one is the Samsung Tab A, um, 10 inch model. Um, I think it's an SMT580. Um, it, you would only have to reset it in the event that you forget the password or if you've got anything nasty cropping up on your device, um, so any malicious software or that sort of thing. So this is a really simple process to do. First thing you do is turn it off um, and then you've got to put it into recovery. So in order to do that we need to hold down the home button and on the side here we need to hold down the volume up and the power together. And then once the device turns on we need to release the, pop, the power button. So I press the home button, press those two together until it turns on. Hopefully this will come out on camera. And then we release the power button. And it should go, so there we go. Should now have a recovery screen. Let me just flip this back around so it's the right way up so I can see it. So, what this is going to do, it's going to say installing system update for probably 30 or 40 seconds, um, and then it's going to say that it's failed. So, there we are, no command. And then after it comes past this screen, it's going to take you to another menu. So, if we just hang on a second, I can show you that as well. There we go. So let me just zoom in a bit so you can see this a bit clearer. So on this screen you've got lots of options. So uh, the one that we're interested in is wipe data and factory reset. So using the volume keys, if you press volume down you move down the list. So move down until we highlight that one and then you press the power button once. And then that's going to ask you, are you sure you want to do this? You're going to lose all your data and we're just going to go down to yes. And at that point, at the bottom of the screen, let me just zoom out. It's going to say that it's done it down here. So white formatting data, formatting cache, data wipe complete. And then again, using the volume keys, we're going to go down this list until we get to the one that says uh, power off. In fact, actually reboot system now at the top one, that'll be all right. And then the device is going to reboot at that point. And then that's pretty much it. You just need to wait until the device comes back on and then you'll be able to use it. So this process will take about two minutes to go through and then it will be back in its factory default settings. Anyway, I'll leave you to watch that uh, doing its reset, but if you like the video, please drop us a like, press the bell icon uh, to get future notifications and subscribe, and uh, hopefully I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.